See this big pencil. Do you want to be able to get it as quickly as humanly possible? Then make sure you watch to the end because I'm going to be going through the best ways you can grind trophies in Season 7. I'm also going to be checking out some of the rewards and I'm going to be sending out a new code. And also, I am giving away a Season Pass in my Discord server. So make sure you go join that. Link is in the description. However, um, yeah, enjoy. Ah! Season 7 finally it's here okay lads so we just had the update for season seven now i've uh i've been trying to find a couple glitches with this and i've managed to find one so make sure you stick around to the end so you can use this glitch to get all of the trophies however this is season seven you click this little check the flag icon here you've got 44 days to do it you've obviously got the free pass here with a couple cool things but then you have the season pass which you can get for like i think it's like 400 robux and then you have these tasks as always this it's, it's the regular stuff i'll be real you got tasks which can get you a couple extra trophies but let's go through the rewards you can get from this season so the season seven is based upon like drag cars uh that type of theme so if you get 200 trophies you can get a rim which looks quite cool from here for 900 trophies you can get this uh block of cheese looking car for 2500 trophies you can get the oh what is this my drag race car knowledge is not on point you can get this blue thing and i'm gonna go on to this uh afterwards however for the season pass 500 trophies you can get this drag gtr this r35 gtr for 1500 trophies you get a wrap for the block of cheese car you got earlier and for 4000 trophies now i was a bit confused with this car because i'm not joking right it's actually it's actually called funny car now i was so confused when this when i saw this but apparently that's actually what it's called in real life just funny car and then last but not least for 7,000 trophies in the free pass you get this really sick looking drag so i'm gonna check this out in a bit once i go through the glitch however that is 7,000 trophies so that is sort of like the grand prize for this season we don't have like a new limited with this update we also have a new code so if i head to settings this code is drag race i think that gives you yeah gives you 75 grand let's try and think what is the best way you can grind trophies this season now every single time a season comes out i make one of these because the best way to get trophies really varies every single season there was a season where you could use the helicopter glitch in the drift race there was a season where you could use the regera glitch on the drag race but the drift race thing is patched so we're not gonna be using that instead we're gonna be using now um this is kind of cheating because i'm pretty sure this is a limited yeah i am pretty sure that the car i'm about to use is a limited however the glitch you can use is with a cadillac which i don't have As you can see from there, I'm the owner of car dealership tycoon, uh, Foxy, um, sorry about that mate, okay. So now that I'm in the testing game, I can actually show you all of the different rewards we have here. So I'm not gonna go over like these ones, maybe I'll touch on them. Uh, but let's just kick off with, li literally, I'm not even joking, it's called Funny Car. Now this thing's four and a half million, I don't know what on earth this is meant to be. I'm not really knowledgeable on drag cars, but it's got the Southwest Florida sticker headlights. And now one thing I've noticed about these uh, drag cars is if when you hold W, the flames on the exhaust actually just stay on. Like I'm holding W now, they don't go away. And this thing is pacey, I'll be real. I'm, I'm in like a little pod. The thing about these drags is, is they can't really turn. We'll see that more when I take out this thing, the top fuel. Now it's worth 7 million. This is this is going to set you back 7,000 trophies. This thing is humongous. Very long, very pointy like a drags that should be a massive spoiler. Interior is kind of non-existent. You've got a steering wheel linked to the two wheels and no pedals. I don't know how I'm, this thing's going forward. But yeah, let me just show you how quick this thing is. I'm flooring it, and oh my goodness gracious, this thing is so fast. Okay, okay, let's uh, let's come to a stop. Yeah, I can't lie, this thing is outrageously fast. I'd say that this is very much worth getting, because this thing is just insane. If you... And you may have also noticed, I have got the 200 trophy rims on this car. This is what they look like. They're a bit scuffed, because it's, uh, it's a massive car, but you can see the rim here. But yeah, let's head to the drag race. Um, yeah, let, let's just do a drag race, I guess. Oh, my goodness gracious. Oh, my dear. Okay, I'm gonna go on to the glitch in a bit, actually. Yeah, the thing is, because this is the dragster, 
it doesn't really turn. Okay, let's do um, let's do a half mile. See what we can do here. I'm gonna be going over the best ways you can grind trophies. It's not just gonna be the Cadillac. Oh my days, I can't speak English. It's not just gonna be the Cadillac glitch. I'm gonna have other glitches, or well, not glitches, but just grinding methods that you can follow in order to do that. Now, if you hold space bar when you start, you actually do a wheelie, which is quite cool. Eight seconds with a speed of 300 miles an hour. Now that will be different to what it is in the real game because this is only testing. They've probably altered it a bit, but it, that, that's just to give you an idea of how fast this thing is and i can tell you right now it's very fast okay so let's take out the cadillac pro gpt now this is the car that you can use this glitch on now i understand this is a limited but i'm going to be going on to the best way you can grind trophies just from like a from like a new player perspective if you get what i mean so what you want to do if you have the cadillac now this may work with other cars i actually don't know all i know is it works with this cadillac but what you want to do you know what i've just done i'm an idiot because you want to know why i'm an idiot it's meant to be negative maximum, not positive maximum. So I've now got to take all of these and go all the way back. Do not make that mistake, please. Oh my god. Two thousand years. So if you're watching this and you've just put everything positive, I'm so sorry from the bottom of my heart because I've been here for like I can just type it. What am I doing? Now apparently this there's a glitch with this that makes it go really bloody fast. Yeah, there we go. There it is. Now, you basically do the drag race with that, and you basically complete it very quickly. And if you have two people, you get more uh, You get more trophies. So, basically, what you do is you just keep doing that. I don't have two people here to do the race with me. Now, there is a glitch where it doesn't align you perfectly in the middle. So, if I go straight into a wall, um, please don't blame me. Okay, I don't think it worked that time. Oh, there we go. Now, now it works. Now I wants to do it when I finish the bloody race. Oh, my day. Okay, yeah, I can't lie. This glitch is a bit temperamental. I've only managed to get it to work, like, once. I don't really know how to do it, but if some of you know how to do it, uh, do let me know in the comments, because, um... Oh, there we go. I, I did it again. I think you just have to, like, turn really hard at some point, and you have to time it perfectly, but if you can master this glitch, which I don't really have the time to do, then you should be on your way to getting that top fuel very quickly. The other thing you can do is this joint here, the Dune Race. Now, now this is for people who don't really have a drift car, don't have a Cadillac. If you just want to get trophies pretty quickly, you can just do the Dune race. It gives a good amount of trophies. You can do this with 12 people as well. So you, there's plenty of space for getting more trophies. I don't know what the best car is for this race because it kind of just depends on your skill. However, I believe with two people, only two people, you can get 22 to 24 trophies, which is pretty darn good. So let's just do this race, see how many trophies we can get. I'm only doing one lap, so this number may be quite low. So that I got five trophies from that, which for one lap in 20 seconds is pretty darn good. But if you do this with four laps and you have multiple people, uh, it's gonna be easy. So that was sort of like a warm-up lap, I'll be real. Now, now I'm gonna try and try my hardest on these four laps, see what, see what I can do. Eventually. Okay, so I'm just finishing up this four-lap June race, one person. Let's see how many trophies I get. 20 trophies for a minute and a half's work with one person that is pretty good if you have 12 people in this you're gonna be getting that cat the cadillac the thing above the top fuel in no time you want to pick the grinding method that's got that's sort of like tailored to whatever status you're at in the game obviously if you've got like a toyota prius then you're obviously not going to do that well however the third and final grinding method i'm going to teach you is the drift race now currently this doesn't work in the game, and I'm pretty sure that they're working to patch it, so don't take this one for granted, but this is basically how you you are meant to grind trophies for the past, like, two, three seasons. The number of trophies you can get caps at 75 trophies, which is around 60,000 points, which is difficult to get if you've not got a good car, but if you've got a pretty good car like this Porsche I've got here, then uh, you'll be there in no time. As long as you keep the boost. Like, look at that. I just got rid of my boost. And now now, now I've got a... Yeah, now I'm in a wall. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Just spam the space bar. A and D. No, don't get rid of my boost. Oh, for God's sake. So the way I like to do this is just to go to this little circle behind the start line and just do a bunch of circles here. There you go. You can see that boost building up. Never mind. Okay, I did a bit better there, but then again, I just can't drift. So I've only got 16,000 points from that. Apparently, 
there are people out there who can get like 60,000 points. I'm definitely not one of them. But as you can see, you can get quite a good amount of trophies from doing the drift race. Yeah, those are basically the three best grinding methods you can use to get trophies nowadays. Two of them might not work when you're watching this because the drift race doesn't actually work while I'm recording this in the actual game. And then the June, sorry, the Cadillac glitch is very temperamental. It may take a bit of time to get used to, but if you do have a Cadillac or you do have a car that can do that glitch, then um, I'd probably go with that. Otherwise, June race is probably going to be your best bet with as many people and as and as many laps as you can do. However, that is basically it. And um, yeah, I, I enjoy the season, I guess. Bye.